Hello there, I am Giant Quill with more Pokemon Ruby Redo. In the last part, we got here to the Pokemon League in Evergrande City, the north part of Evergrande City. Uh, we bought, we finished up Victor Road basically, and we battled a couple more trainers, and then we battled Wally at the end and beat him in a battle, so that's pretty cool. We had a Gardevoir, his vaults evolved into Curlia, and then evolved into Gardevoir, and we got to battle him. He had five Pokemon. I think they were Delcati, Gardevoir, uh, Roselia, um, Magneton, and, uh, think of the fifth Pokemon, honestly, I'll put a text overlay you know, right now, and then I'll show what Pokemon I missed, because I missed those, are, I listed four, but there, he was had, he had five Pokemon, so yeah. Okay, yeah. So, as I said, I trained all my Pokemon up to level 56, so let me go through the summaries, um, everyone had their, uh, final, um, moves that come in, into training, so no one really learned anything new. I didn't want any, you know, any Pokemon, any of my Pokemon learn anything new, really. So yeah, um, so Fido Hariyama, oh by the way, this is the order, uh, in training I took, okay, so Twitch was the first one, first Pokemon of mine to reach level 56 in training, then, then Skarmory, uh, Grumpig, I guess, Grumpig, then Skarmory, then Tentacruel, then Quisceptile, then Torkoal, and then, then Hariyama. So yeah. So let's go to the summaries, I guess. So, yeah, fighters, no, it's Brick Brick, Quick, uh, I must say Quick Attack, wow, I say it right there. Uh, Brick Brick, Earthquake, um, Fire Throne, Facade, uh, Smoky Nose, uh, Flamethrower, Fire Blast, Body Slam, and Overheat. By the way, I gave one, one PP up to, uh, Fire Blast, I had five, I had eight of these in total, eight PP ups in total that I used. So, yeah, that I had, actually. And I used them all. Yeah, um, I used one PP up on, uh, two PP, three PP up, two PP up, three PP up, there we go, on Fire Bus, and one on, uh, Overheat. So that's four right there, I used four PP ups there. So yeah, it knows Flamethrower, Fire Bus, Buy Slam, and Overheat. Oh yeah, I used two PP ups on, uh, Overheat, and three PP ups, PP ups on Fire Bus. That's cool, that's five actually right there. Cool. So yeah, there's, Gig, uh, Subtile, my Geico knows, uh, Giga Drain Dragon, Colossal, Beam, Leaf Blade. Uh, I used three PP ups on, uh, Giga Drain. So five PP ups I used on Twinkle or Smokey. And then I used three PP ups on Subtile or Geico. Yeah. So that's three plus five is eight. So I had eight full, eight, I had eight PP ups. So that's where they went to. Cause, uh, Giga Drain, Fire Blast, and Overheat all had, uh, originally just five PP each. So yeah. So yes, Geico knows Giga Drain, Dragon Claw, Solar Beam, Millie Blade. I think I repeat myself there, but that's okay. Just in case. Metroid knows Sludge Bomb, Ice Beam, Waterfall, and Surf. Skarmory knows, or I guess, uh, Screamo knows Air Cutter, Arrow Ace, Seal Wing, and Fly. Uh, Twitch the Grumpig knows Shadow Ball, Psychic, Shockwave, and Psy Beam, and that's it really. So yeah. So I did a test run of the Wii 4. Uh, it wasn't that much of a challenge, but that's okay. I just like to just brush through the Wii 4, you know, I don't really care for it if it's too challenging, but that's okay. That's why I trained all my Pokemon to level 56, well, the only person I really had trouble on was Steven, but we'll get to that when we get to that, which is probably three, two to three points from now, or three or four points from now, if I were to guess. Which, uh, if I do something about that, okay, this part, next part's gonna be the second member of the Wii 4, the part after that's gonna be the third member of the Wii 4, the part after that's gonna be the fourth member of the Wii 4, and then the four points, uh, Four points after the, this part will be the champion battle, so that's pretty cool. Let's walk into the, into the, um, st uh, I guess area, the room, our first member of Elite Four. It is Sydney, the master of dark type Pokemon, so let's talk to him from the side. Yeah. Welcome, Challenger. I'm Sydney of the Elite Four. I like that you're giving me, I like that look you're giving me. I guess you, you've, you'll you give me a good match. That's good. Looking real good. Alright, you and me, you and me, let's enjoy a battle that can only be staged here in the Pokemon League. I like the Elite Four music, it's pretty cool. So yeah. Before Sydney would like the battle, of course. Yes, five Pokemon, nice. So, I know that one Brick Brick on this Mariana from Fighter will faint it in one hit, pretty much. Unless I get very unlucky. So let's see this Brick Brick. This Mariana is level 46 in male. So yeah, let's just try to knock it out. There we go, nice. Took that one hit, awesome. So yeah, we were 10 levels higher than it too, so yeah. That helped, uh, yeah, cool. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna switch out. Actually, I'm gonna keep Fighter in. 
because fighter is a boss. Okay, this is just level 48 in male, so let's use another brick brick on it. Let's get his double team. This was a, you know, a thing in my test run for the week 4 was that I, uh, fighter couldn't really hit it. And then, but luckily fighter hit it this time on the first try. Yeah, awesome. So this shifter goes down. Awesome. So yeah. Nice. Okay, he's going to use Absol next. We'll stay in. I know this Absol is level 49. I don't know if it's male or female. Okay, it's a male and it's level 49. Awesome. Let's go for the Brick Brick again. It's going to use Aoyce. That's covering its weaknesses. Because, you know, it's fight type, fighting type Pokemon. We get fights. Probably face against this Absol because fighting and bug types are uh, super effective against the dark type. Yeah, but there we go. The Another one he care. Awesome. Nice. Okay. Sydney is about to use Cacturn. Okay, we'll stay in again. The only Pokemon I'm not staying in, keeping in fighter with, again, to fight against is a Sharpedo. So this Cacturn is a voice six in male. Let's go for Let's just keep on using Brick Brick. Brick Brick is just a go to move right now, you know, for this battle. Of course it is. There we go. Nice. 20 KO. Awesome. Nice. So that was that. And then he has one more Pokemon, a Sharpedo. We're gonna actually switch to Geico for that. So yeah. Mix it up a little bit. <laughs> nice. Sharpedo, yeah. It's level 48 in male, so we're 8 levels higher than it, but that's okay. Let's go for the Leaf Blade. Uh, it could be, I think it's, you know, it's gonna faint it, you know, based on my test run. And it does. Awesome. One hit KO. So we one shot all his Pokemon, basically. Yeah. Rough skin, though. Ouch. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So that's, that's that, you know? Disease is that. Well, how do you like that? I lost. Eh, it was fun. Uh, so it doesn't matter. I like your positive attitude, Sydney. It's really cool. Thanks for 4,900 Poké Dollars, man. Appreciate it, man. I appreciate it. Well, listen to what this loser has to say. You've got to what it takes to go far. Now, go on to the next room. Enjoy your next battle. Okay, let's go to the next room then. Yep. On to the second member of the late four. Cool. So this is uh, Phoebe, Elite Four Phoebe. I remember my original Pokemon Ruby walkthrough guide. I didn't know how to pronounce her name, but uh, I know now that's Phoebe, Elite Four Phoebe, the master of ghost type Pokemon. So yeah. So yeah, so this is, I'm gonna end the part right here though. So this is my Pokemon Ruby Ruby Walk Day part. The next part will take on the second member of Elite Four Phoebe, master of ghost type Pokemon, as I said before. So yeah, so this has been Janko again. Wait, we should heal actually. Before I actually end the part, jeez, I'm rushing. I should heal, obviously, because, you know, some my Pokemon did take damage. So she has a super potion there. And, yeah, I was trying to end the part too soon, you know? It's crazy. Okay, I'm going to use a potion, yeah. Kind of got a little ahead of myself there. Dang it, oh my gosh, it's just another potion then. Okay, fine, whatever. Okay, cool. Dang it, I didn't mean to go back to my bag. Okay, so... Who is going to be a front... I think I put Scream out front. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. So yeah, so now this has been done in my Pokemon Redo. Pokemon would be Redo Walk that part. The next part will take on the second member of the way four, Phoebe, the master of ghost type Pokemon. So this is from Dragon Go again. I would like to get goodbye, and I'm to see you guys next part of my Pokemon Ruby Redo Walkthrough Guide.